All right, so uh, today I kind of wanted to show you guys the, uh, I guess it's the 2013 Ruger LCP. Um, I've shot many uh, of the other previous ones, and I guess uh, the engineers and the people there like to roll out stuff gradually, and they don't really like to announce anything, but uh, I'm going to unbox this and I'll show you what I mean. This is the only video I've seen. I've seen one video that kind of references this, but I wanted to kind of put this out there for everybody else. So I just picked up this LCP uh, at a gun show this past weekend uh, for 300 bucks. Um, considering all the weight everything is right now, it's kind of hard to find, you know, handguns in general. So here we go. Let's see. <clears throat> so you get the LCP, little gun case. Get the lock and mag. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it comes with the extended grip right here for, I guess, you know, depending on how big your hands are, if you can get the second, complete second finger on there, or, you know, if you're a woman, maybe all, all three. But, anyways, and it also comes with the um, flat. There you go. Which I'll probably use this uh, for carry. Uh, just something else to cause a print. But, anyways, hold six, one in the chamber. <clears throat> now to the LCP. I wanted to get to that real quick. Um, I did notice that the clip release is a little bit stiffer than normal. I'll, I'll just gun check this for you, but it's new. Nothing in there. But, anyways, what I want to show you is a uh, couple things. Um, the sights are, are, are normally not even non existent, but if you can see, there's actually raised sights there a little bit. You know, I wouldn't consider these sights like on a normal handgun, but these are protruding more so than a normal LCP. You can actually see through it. Um, the other is uh, the trigger pull is slightly, I mean, it's, it's the same pressure, it's 8 pounds pull, but if you can see the break point, it's a lot quicker. And I'll show you, too, if you can see the hammer. It's back just a smite, a little bit, like a quarter of an inch maybe, already, but it's still flush. And I guess that's the reason for the shorter break. Um, I actually called Ruger, their uh, support, and asked them about it because I just want to make sure I didn't get anything that was kind of you know funky or whatever. But it, and they won't acknowledge it. They they have no idea what I'm talking about. Uh, although I've seen many other people uh, in forums asking, uh, like I said, that's the reason I want to make this. Um, one thing you'll notice is uh, if you do have the newer model, is there there's no dash in the serial number. Um, there's usually three numbers, a dash, and then some more numbers. This one's just numbers all the way across. Um, anyways, like I said, just wanted to do a, a brief review on that and let you guys know that they have rolled out something, some a couple of small changes in the new Ruger LCP. Uh, so just be aware of that. Uh, even though um, Ruger will and the tech support people will not acknowledge it, and they just consider you know everything up to spec. So, anyways, I hope this helps. Um, stay tuned for some more videos.